Today I'm going to make a vlog and just show you what I'm doing, what I'm eating, where I'm going, who I'm with. I probably won't be with anybody, but anyways, right now I'm drinking a um, half gallon of water, but I'm not going to have all of it because I am going running right now. I'm actually going to do a hill workout um, instead of like a longer distance run just because I like to do like a hill kind of sprint workout maybe at least once a week, maybe twice a week, just so that I can get some strength and speed in there rather than just consistently doing um, long distance because obviously, you know, your body needs change and you shouldn't do the same thing every day because then it gets used to it and blah, 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 blah. So that's what I'm going to do today. And I am going to try to go to the farmer's market. So I will show you that and then... I'll show you what I'm eating. I haven't eaten anything yet, but uh, I will show you what I do happen to eat today, which I don't know what it will be yet. So hopefully this video will be interesting because, uh, I don't know, I haven't really been filming in a while and I'm going to be trying to get videos up there consistently and up my social media game. And also, I did kind of realize that I might have not been exactly myself in all my videos just because like I am I, at least I was trying to be like this like happy like I don't know just you know like that kind of person and I mean I'm not saying I'm not a happy person but just be more real and not really worry about like being perfect in my videos because I've been watching a lot of Darian Rider's videos and he's just like you gotta be like real and stuff and not that I'm like just listening to everyone doing what everyone else is saying <laughs> But I think it's true, like, I do like watching videos where people are just being themselves and just talking to the camera and, like, saying whatever's on their mind, and I feel like I should do that more rather than trying to, like, plan out what I'm going to say. <sighs> but anyways, hopefully that makes sense. My arm hurts. I need to stretch. So, yeah, I'll just show you guys what I'm doing today. I'm sorry, I'm just talking a lot. <gasps> okay, bye! I'm finally making breakfast. So this is what I'm going to throw into the blender right here. So this is for... Uh, large mangoes and I just uh, scooped out the insides of them and there's a lot of juice on the bottom and for some reason they look really yellow in this light right now but they're actually pretty orange and they were really ripe. I have a bowl of frozen fruit and it's pineapple, mango, banana, and peaches so I'm just gonna use some of that and then I have like almost a quarter, I think it's like three cups of fresh squeezed orange juice. So I'm going to throw all of this in the blender and make a big smoothie. Please ignore if you can hear the horrible country music in the background, but look how beautiful this is. Oh my god, it's so good. It smells good. It tastes good. It's like the most beautiful color ever. And it's so smooth too. It's just so perfect. I don't even know. I've never made this smoothie before, but it's so good. I just had all these mangoes laying around and they were like the stringy kind, so I didn't really want to eat them plain, so I just decided to blend them. Oh, it's so good. And I still have some more in the blender. This is like the best smoothie ever. And it's perfect right now because it's such a sunny day. So, if you guys want to try this, you should, because it's real good. So I'm going to go eat this now, and then head to the beach, and hopefully the farmer's market. Guys, are you ready for the final taste? Part two. Mmm. 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 So, I was just watching Fully Raw Christina's newest recipe video, Fettuccine Alfredo with the zucchini noodle thing. And I have, I showed this in one of my other videos, but I have these two giant homegrown zucchinis that are like really giant. And I haven't done anything with them yet because I wasn't sure what to do. But since she posted that video, I think I might try and make that recipe tonight. So that's probably what I'll be having for dinner. 
going to the beach, to the beach, to the beach. Got my smoothie. Gotta drink this before we leave, but I'm going to the beach. And this is my thing that I'm wearing. <laughs> I don't even know. <laughs> I literally just took this shirt that I'm wearing right now. It's the shirt, not a dress, but it's really big. And I just cut the sleeves off. And it's like all open, but it's all good. Just got crafty, you know. Alright, so here's everything I'm taking to the beach with me. I got water and a green juice. I got some cherries and I'm bringing my argan oil, sunscreen, my favorite chapstick ever, which is the coconut water brand and I got this for free and it's the best chapstick ever. And of course, skinny bitch. We're all packed up and ready to go to the beach. So we're off to the farmer's market right now, and then we are going to the beach after I get some fruit. the only thing that I ended up getting at the farmer's market because uh, we already have peaches and nectarines and plums and that was kind of all there was there so I ended up just getting a basket of passion fruit and this was three dollars and they're kind of they're all like different sizes and shapes this one's yellow these ones are purple this is green and I just got these from the farmer's market because I can never find them in stores. So this is the only thing that I got. But, um, yeah, it was fine. The I was kind of hoping that this certain stand would be there, but it wasn't. So that was a little disappointing, but it's fine. I got passion fruit, so now I can be happy. Right now I'm eating a bowl of strawberries and three pluots, which are plums and apricots, mixed together. So, I'm just gonna eat these and then I'll make dinner. Look what I just found. He was caught in a spider web. It's a tiny little baby lizard. So I'm gonna go put him in this wood pile over here so he can hide. Come here. Hopefully, I think he's a little scared right now. There you go. He has spider webs on his little feet. There you go. Good. Yay! I made it. I actually made like something. I'm really proud. This is um Fully Rock Christina's fettuccine alfredo that she posted today. And I decided to make it because I had giant zucchinis and First of all, my spiralizer literally, like, it sucks so bad. So it's more like macaroni than it is like noodles, but that's fine. So anyways, I followed the recipe, um, whatever, the dressing recipe, but I added a clove of garlic, and I also put some almond milk in there just to make it a little bit more creamy. And I just had a bite, and it's pretty good. I mean, it's not like... I mean, honestly, I didn't really ever eat Alfredo that much before, but, um, it's better than I actually expected. It's pretty good. And, yeah, it is pretty creamy. So, this is tasty. I'm going to eat all this. And I'm also drinking the rest of that water. And, yeah, so that's about what I'm going to have for the rest of the day. Alright, it's really bright out right now, but I just wanted to say thank you guys for watching this video, 
and I hope you liked it. It was kind of just a vlog slash rant slash what I eat in a day, so uh, I didn't really have, <laughs> I don't know, I just kind of filmed everything, so hopefully you guys liked this video. Let me know if you did, and if you have any questions, leave them in the comments below, and yeah, I'll be making more video. I'll be, I'll be making more videos, so I'll see, <laughs> I'll see you soon, bye!